Hey y'all, welcome to day two of Vlogmas. Oh my gosh, it's only day two, but I feel like, girl, we doing a damn thing, okay? We went to Brenda's this morning because today is actually my birthday. Um, a little hesitant because I didn't know if I was going to bring this up on the vlog or not because I am not celebrating my birthday the way that I thought I would be okay and that's just because you know life happens sometimes we make plans and you know sometimes them plans don't work out going in this next year and for me girl my new year starts now my birthday so it's a new year for me all right i want to treat every day every week every month as something you know like it's special like i don't want to have to wait till my birthday i don't want to have to wait till summer i don't want to have to wait till a certain holiday i want to be able to do what i want to do when i want to do it okay and just start experiencing more things like going to more events that are local to me trying restaurants that i've been wanting to try or trying like new stuff like just living girl like for real um but <laughs> let's go back to brenda's so brenda's um is like a cajun restaurant i believe they started in san francisco and they have a location in oakland on broadway i have tried them on doordash before like for breakfast um but i never went there i honestly was low-key against supporting brenda's because brenda's is not black owned but to me they serve black food but you could argue it's cajun food as well but for me it's black food um but on the window they do have a huge black lives matter sign and they've had that up since you know we were doing all them riots riots and things and they are one of the few businesses that did not take theirs down um and i'm sure they get a lot of flack for them being um not black owned but being so close to black food um so i went there because i wanted a good breakfast and i wanted something that kind of tasted like homemade if you will and it gave that it definitely gave that i just got like the breakfast with the eggs uh some andouille sausage and their grits are so good they're so buttery they're a little thin i wish they were a little thicker but the grits are so good girl i tried the beignet just because i was like in house and you know i feel like you need to get a beignet fresh um on the menu they only tell you they have flights but you can order an individual or a single beignet girl that beignet was not good i don't you know i've never had like a a real beignet i like would say like from new orleans um those are like where you can get real beignets but i think they're supposed to be like airy and fluffy like it shouldn't just be full of dough and the um the uh the beignet i had it was doughy it was hard kind of like it was like it was fried too hard and it was just filled with dough so it wasn't very good to me i'm glad i just got one um but the breakfast was really good and i got me a mimosa which was really cute it was a little expensive the mimosa was ten dollars uh for eight ounces supposedly um so yeah that was that for breakfast and then tonight we have reservations for mama i've actually been there before it's a um it's italian restaurant but it's a set menu and they like rotate the menu on a weekly basis i went maybe a couple months ago by myself it was really really good like really good like i was kind of blown away um so i was like i want to make sure i eat something that i'm going to enjoy and then it won't be the same thing because obviously the menu is different so i made a reservation for mama for tonight um these nails are embarrassing so we need to take these nails off um they're kind of like on for real so i think i'm gonna have to like soak them off and then i think i'm gonna do my nails i don't want to do too much because i feel like 
getting dressed is such a task but it's it's my birthday like i should feel like a bad bitch you know what i mean so um i got this hair wet so it looks insane i need to put this wig on girl i need to do all the things i need to put this wig on i need to do my nails and then we're gonna have to curl this wig <sighs> it's a lot girl but yeah it's a bad bitch birthday just had to let y'all know let let me let me talk to y'all who this year or you know in the past you may not have celebrated yourself as you may have wanted to and, and it's okay baby it's okay you know i'm just so grateful that i made it another year i don't Girl, if I cry, I cry on this camera, I will burn this whole motherfucker down. Don't play with me. <laughs> but no, 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 no. I'm just grateful that I've made it another year. You know, it's been tough emotionally, physically. And, you know, I could have been gone. To be quite honest with y'all, I could have been gone. Okay? So, um... I'm grateful to be here, regardless of where I'm celebrating my birthday at, who I'm celebrating my birthday with. I'm so grateful for, to be here. I'm grateful to have loved ones and people who support me. And um, yeah, so y'all don't get discouraged if you feel like, you know, you're not doing your big one on your birthday. Like, your big one is still being here. Y'all aren't good at raising these kids. And Shady Pines got jello. <laughs> Girl, put, like, you, mean, you know what I mean? No, the answer to that. Yeah. So, God bless them. And I feel like at the very same time, what we need to be focused on as far as the hair uh, family is concerned, heiress. Oh, the vocalist? <laughs> Living. Oh, that's a legend in the making. <laughs> Similar to, okay. to J. Cole. Uh, yeah. um, so, I don't know if that's inspo or coincidence or whatever, but I feel like he could get with his father. One thing I will give T.I. is that Betty is that can rap. rap. Of course. Betty can rap. We'll never deny that. We'll never deny that. But, but my, the oldest one, I believe, my parents mess, which we've done a million times. I have no problem with that. That's mm -hmm. fine. But as far as the kids go, I'm not going to sit up here and be talking about this child, his teeth, his behavior, or whatever, when, especially as an empath, I'm looking at slow music that's really good. Mm. Like, the kids are creative artists all on their own right now, mm. and I think that's beautiful. And if I'm going to talk about them, I'd rather be talking about that versus this kid who needs family therapy. Well, it can be both out. talented or be successful because when confronted. You can still have a lot of emotional damage that don't nobody know nothing about. And you just out here being successful and fine. And it's, but like, look at what this screenshot is in my my docs from his story. He's, he 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 like, took a picture in a car. The caption says, "I'm breaking." Like, come on, bro. If I'm a mistake, then just say that. That breaks my heart. Why does he feel that way? Oh, shoot, these kids would much rather yeah. be strong. Good morning, y'all. It is December 1st, but y'all don't really know. I mean, this, we are, what, one day ahead of time. So, this is what we need to stay. We do not need to be filming the video day of. You feel me? This is a little bit too close, but, you know, we're we going to do what it do. Anyways, y'all, last time I saw y'all, oh, my cap, all the way back there, huh? I don't even know. Anyways, last time I saw y'all, I was telling y'all that I wanted to do my nails, do my hair and stuff to go to dinner last night for my birthday. I took my nails off and honey, that, that took all my energy. Okay. I was like so, um, I was so tired yesterday. And um, I had took a nap because I'm like, you know, maybe if I take a nap, I can wake up and then like at least do my hair. Because I had got to the point where I was like, girl, it don't look like you're about to be wearing makeup, but you could do some hair. And um, so that's what I was going to do. Basically, I, I was not feeling good enough to go to dinner yesterday, which I mean, oh, my wig is lifting a little bit, but I just I didn't even put no glue on. I literally put it water on the lace because there was already glue there and expected it to be something so kind of my fault and then 
<laughs> yesterday I had put the wig on. Like I had actually put glue and stuff on yesterday. Because I had washed. I look so crazy. I had washed the lace or whatever. So like it was like all poofy and stuff. Girl, when I had took the uh when I had took my band off, my wig look it looked so crazy. So I was like, you know what? I, I really don't have it in me to be um to pull a a miracle. Cause that's what it looked like that wig needed a miracle like i am in dire need of a new wig like i have put this wig on so many different times this lace is thick hard like girl it's a mess so um that is so funny i kind of want to go to fort green if you're from Oakland, you should probably know what Fort Greene is, maybe. It's a bar in um, what they call Old Oakland. And um, it's not only a bar, but they have like games that kind of, they have like a, a couple of like arcade games there. And then it's also, um, they share space with Chingones, which is a uh, Mexican restaurant. So, if you don't necessarily want to drink, you can go there just to, um, like, chill and get food. Um, but if you do want to drink, the drinks are pretty, like, well-priced, I would say. And they have some really good bartenders. Like, really good bartenders. Um, I'm a bourbon girl. Bourbon girl down. And, uh, used... I used to always order like a Kentucky bur a Kentucky bourbon, a Kentucky mule, which is basically if you drink Moscow mules, which is um, vodka, ginger beer, and what else? Vodka, ginger beer, and like lime juice is a Moscow mule. So a Kentucky mule, same thing, girl. It's just bourbon, ginger beer. And mine. So I used I usually order that when I I go there because they do it like really really well. Girl, I need to get you see this bump right here. That's because I have a pin right there because this wig is actually too small for my goddamn head. I gotta stop cussing y'all. But this wig is too small for my head, so it doesn't like come down so when I'm doing it and especially because we're on camera I might not put no edges because I really just don't feel like it um when I'm doing it you you would see everything you probably just saw something there but yeah this wig is too small girl and I made this wig myself so I can't blame it on nobody but me okay see that looks so much better I should have known that last night. But also, I think last night I had put this wig on too low. But yeah, y'all, we need to film. We need to film the first day of the uh, Trader Joe's advent calendar today for TikTok. Um, yeah, so I wanted to do a little something to my hair. Oh yeah, y'all. So I'm about to put a little bit of curls. In this hair, I want to pull an E cane and just curl the front, but that might not work. So I'm gonna put a little bit of curls and then I'll be back. Y'all, because I don't have bobby pins, I'm using this to hold my wig in, and these are very uncomfortable, as you can probably imagine. And they're bulky. Girl, good thing I don't have a man because he would run his hair through my wig his hands through my wig and be like, what in the technology? <laughs> Y'all, I met a friend at the bar and we're supposed to be going to first Friday together. Oh my god. I don't know how to thank y'all though, because it's dark as hell and I don't have a light, so 
Y'all might not be going, but I'm excited.